Hi there, this is Crazy Drawer and you're watching my let's play of Vampire the Masquerade. This is a new concept to me, I'm not used to doing these and we're going to start off with a new game. Now I've played this game before, um, played it as a Malkavian through and I'm planning to go as a Torridor. Okay, yep. Prefer playing the males because I feel the females look a little bit haggard no matter what gender you're playing as. And, well, to be fair, they are. And yes, I'm sticking with the name Oscar. I've been pro I have been monkeying around with it a bit. <laughs> um, and I'll go with this history. Um, right. I've. I'm just doing this as quickly as possible because I roughly know what because it take it do, it's got a long a longish introduction and then you got the tutorial on top of it. <laughs> um, okay, dokie. Uh, which one? Which one? I think I think I'll go with celerity and. Alright, here we go. The Embrace. Act 1, Scene 1. <laughs> um, yeah, it's just a pretty effect. So I actually like the loading screen. I know that sounds random, but compared to most games, it actually makes it look nice and <laughs> suits the game. How many bras? I mean, come on! I don't think the guy would mind finding out that his new that his new his new lady friend happens to have fangs. I think he'd just find it as a new kink. <laughs> so yeah, I'm very sorry. It'd have to be something even more terrifying, unless the guy is really that shallow. <laughs> as long as she doesn't go for the penis, I don't think he minds. <laughs> Oh bless him. <laughs> he looks so out of place. <laughs> Sorry, I don't know why I find it funny, it's just so like Good attack! <laughs> my fellow kindred, my apologies for disrupting any business or interfering with prior engagements you may have had this evening. But the leprechaun must speak. The affair that gathers us together tonight is a troubling one. We are here because the laws that bind our society, the laws hey, that you, the stop speaking back there. existence, have been broken. As prince, I am within my I'm rights. I'm quite amazed how she can actually go in anywhere city, outside, walk around town in nothing but her underwear. But Many hey, you have come to me seeking permission, and I have endorsed some of these requests. Oh, what's here? However, <laughs> the accused that sits before you tonight was not. I'm trying not permission. to interrupt. I know you guys Indeed, are trying to watch this introduction, my but. Was never <laughs> It's just these little bits and pieces. Shortly after the embrace of this child, I look shaved. Yeah, look shaved, pal. You so got yourself sired. Yes. Up to tonight, I considered the accused a loyal and upstanding member of our organization. But as some of you may know, the, the incidentally, the guy at the back behind the Tory door is actually the other. It's the choice for um, the and there's the Ventru choice for um, player characters. Because everybody wants a clone of Prince Lacroix. Adhere to the code that binds our society, lest we endanger all of our blood. Forgive me. Let the penalty commence. Cloud called. He wants his sword back. Which leads to the fate of the ill-begotten progeny. Yeah, Without don't forget sire, about me. Most child are doomed to walk the earth never knowing their place, their responsibility, and most importantly, the laws they must obey. Why is that guy Therefore, staring at It's like doing a Jack Sparrow impression at behind him. You know, staring into space. See what I mean? Most of the vampires look haggard. I wouldn't want any of that near me. <laughs> 
I'm not after if Twilight level guess, vampire, but it is a case of half of them are like I have look like they should be drugged. <laughs> look like they, they be look like they are drugged. Of our kind and be granted the same rights. Let no one say I am unsympathetic to the plights and causes of this community. I thank you all for attending these proceedings, and I hope their significance is not lost. What did you say? Good evening. Yay, Gary! Just standing there, you know, really out of place. <laughs> Your sire, tragic, my apologies. But you see, there yeah. is a strict code of conduct that all of us must... must... adhere to, if we wish to... <laughs> I love that look he's giving, like, uh -huh. Anyone breaks these laws, they undermine the well-worn fabric of and our centuries-old society. Normal animation loop Understand of them all do that same strut. Why is it they all Allowing strut? Even the prince is doing it. Is it just copy him? Your subsequent behavior. So, what I'm offering is not generosity, but the opportunity to transcend the fate woven by your sire. This is your trial. You will be brought to Santa Monica. There, you will meet an agent by the name of Mercurio. He will provide the details of your labor. I've shown you great clemency. You Prove haven't it was more than a him, Jack. You've just Don't come killed back. his sire for no real reason, other than the fact that you actually were cranky with him. Ugh. Right. Okay, guys. I'm going to end it here. I know I haven't really done much, and you've just seen the intro, but... I promise I'll be back later to do the actual tutorial. So, yep. See you in a bit. I'm just going to save as a separate save. Yeah, as you can tell, I've had quite a few characters. Uh, just do this quickly. See. This is a joke between me and my mom, actually. And also... There we go. <laughs> it's... Okay, guys. I'll see you later.